Don't you just hate it when you're at a party and everyone's talking about how the number verification API flow works, but you don't know anything about it? Well, don't worry, because I've got you covered on that next one. Here we have a user with a phone who wants to log into their application. The application has a front end, back end, and server. The front end creates a request that includes the client ID, phone number, and scope, and sends it to the server. It's essentially asking, hey server, can you check if this is actually Diana? The server receives the request, does its checks, and tells the front end, yes, but I can't tell you. Number verification can, you should call them, but I'll make you this authorization code backend. Mix code, mix code, mix code. The server then sends the code to the backend. And then the backend is like, cool, thanks, I'll give you this access token in return. Backend exchanges the code for a token. Then the server is like, thanks, now I'll make you a new access token. Mix token, mix token. The server then returns this new token to the backend. Use it to call the number verification API that's been sitting here all this time. And the backend then takes a new token, puts it into this made up phone booth, purely used for visual aid, and calls number verification, asking, is this Diana's phone number? And the API is like, yeah, because it returns a Boolean. Then backend tells front end, yep, it's Diana's phone number. And the front end shows that the login is successful.